Hi, this is Eunice, and I'm here with another eight and a half by eight and a half album that I created using the Child Bella Blooming collection of paper. And in honor of Mother's Day, I decided to make an album that is more feminine and soft, and thought this paper would work really well because it is uh, more on a watercolor. Looking like paper is really gorgeous paper, but all the flowers, roses, my mom and I both love roses. Uh, so just looking at that, I was like, hmm, I wonder what I can do with that. And so this is the outcome that I created. And this here is a lace that I found online and just thought it would just go really well and beautiful with the pearls. And like I say, having my mother in the back of my mind because she liked roses and she likes pearls. So I was like, hey, this this will work. So this is a two and a half inch spine once again. That's how the spine look. And this is the back of the paper. Like I say, soft colors, butterflies, violin, just soft watercolor feel to it. It's really beautiful paper and I really enjoyed working with this. Once again, I kept this album very simple these are some cutouts that i put on there and of course the saying here's to those who inspire us and don't even know it and my mother is one of my greatest inspirations so let's take a peek inside so here's the first page when you open up it's just a side pocket and you pull it out and you have areas for some photos to put on there as well just look how pretty those roses is gorgeous gorgeous paper and i like butterflies who don't but you know the butterflies and the flowers and this soft color i thought just went perfect in this album here is another page once again with the lace and cut aparts and this here pulls up like this and i have some bookmarks in here but of course, you can put a photo here as well as put a photo there or just one long photo if you like. And then it tucks away behind here and it looks like the collar of a dress is sort of the feel that I was going with here and put a little bow there, some little hearts. And of course, you can put photos here as well. Each page, once again, has a pullout where you can put more photos in there. I'm not going to pull out each one. But as you can see, it progressed where we go in a line here. Really pretty from the side when you look at it. Here, once again, just photo mats with cutouts and cut aparts that I use. Fussy cut some, some of them are die cuts. Here as well, you can place a photo here. And a couple of fussy cuts as well on that. Quite simple. This page here with the lantern opens up like this look how beautiful just love these colors these soft muted colors in here and the roses like I say roses is one of my favorites so just fell in love with this paper here's another beautiful photo mat to place photos or whatever else you want to tuck inside there and then you got this page and of course it says mom and I can just imagine a beautiful photo of your mother right there Again, some more pullouts here. This here is a door. I like that door. This is a door that I cut out from the Mente collection. But once again, roses and butterflies open up like this. You can put photos here, photos there, and a couple more photo mats as well. And tuck it away right there in that neat pocket. And then here you have another pocket with plenty of places to place photos or journaling, whatever you would like. This one here opens up like this. You can put a photo here or you can write a little saying, put a poem, and then journal dates or letters or just send as a card if she so desires to do so. And then... This page uh, opens like this. 
and get her photos here as well. And then you can tuck a photo behind here as well. So you can tuck that that way, or you can tuck it up this way. However you would like to do that. And then on the last page, once again, a black pocket is what we call it here. And some more photo mats to place in here as well. So this one here is just plain. I didn't do anything specific or special. Just once again, you can place photos if you choose and just tuck it away like that. And close this up like that. And then from the side. And I like the ribbons. I, I don't know. I just wanted to put several ribbons on here. So I ended up just putting three different types of ribbons. And you can close it up as such. But anyway, that is my album. And I am looking forward to making one in honor of fathers. So that will be my next album. Thank you for looking.